guys, Mike here, back in my shop in Jersey. Um, I thought I'd just say, now I've always, I've always had this DeWalt. Uh, I got this like maybe two or three years ago, but I meant to get the package, which came with the hammer drill, but I, I never got it. So, amazingly at Home Depot, I picked this up yesterday for, believe it or not, $131. I was amazed. I only had two left. I said, I... I'm getting this. I, I had to get it, and I'm I'm loving it so far. It's a really good drill. Um, usually these sell for two twenty nine, I believe, but I'm just amazed I got it for that price. I also picked up bit case, even though I have a shit ton of bits. Just um, I didn't have a lot of these guys, so I got that. But. Oh my god, I love this drill so far. It's really going to help when I'm mounting stuff to the concrete walls here. Because you really need the hammer action for that. Especially when drill. That was a pain in the ass. Mounting that blower with this drill. And this doesn't have a hammer setting. It's It, it still did the job because it's a strong drill. But, it, you know, it would have been a lot easier if I had this. So, yeah. I love it so far. It's really good. And, yeah, I'm happy with it. So that's just the, the DeWalt hammer drill. Kind of these three nice, bright LED lights. Also, I just recently mounted my 10-watt LED under here, which is going to be another little work light for this area now. It's going to be a high-powered work light just for the table, the chop saw area and stuff. I'm going to get power out of the, um, the box here for the dust collector. So whenever you plug this in, you don't have this, you know, it'll be separate. It'll be off the main line coming in here to this. I'm going to run BX back there to it. But, you know, you can run the dust collector too, whatever. And that won't interfere. It's only drawing 10 watts. So, yeah, it's all good. Also, we really got the basement cleaned up here. Cleaned a lot of stuff out. So it's much more empty. We're going to be selling those two exercise machines there. We're selling this. We're eventually going to get rid of that. And my good friend is going to be taking my fan here. So that's going to be out of here. So we're going to have a lot more room down here. And yeah. And the new plan for here. Well, because we got to get rid of this stuff. In between these two beams. Sliding doors. A wall. A wall. There'll be another desk built out of here. But that'll be for like more of the tinkering area. You know. I mean even though that kind of is. This will be where I can have the chair. And little things. And maybe you know I'll work on models or whatever. So. That's what I'm going to have there. But slowly but surely, it's coming along. I think I have another friend who's going to take this off of me. So that's going to be out of here. Same with the window fan. Keeping the Ilga fan. It's going to be a window fan. But that's going to be for myself. That's going to be turned into a stationary work lamp. So, yeah. Uh, that's the deal. So, thanks for watching. little workshop update. And, yeah. I love this thing. I made this thing. More people should make this. I love it. So yeah, that's uh, just a little workshop update. And thanks for watching, guys. Mike out.